What's up pretty girls? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel, hello, how are you? I'm Simone Reed and for today's video, I'm bringing to you this yellow eye look. Um, yeah, so I just decided that I wanted to do a yellow eye today and that's what I did. It's like pouring rain outside. Well, it was pouring rain outside. So I was like, you know what? Let's just dab in a little bit of makeup. Let's do an eye look. And this is what I came up with was this yellow eye look. I think it's perfect for the summertime. So I love it. And I love it with like the part down the middle, hair straight. And then I gave it a pop of um, a crazy lip color by ColourPop. But it's my favorite lip color by ColourPop. And I just like mix it with a black eyeshadow to make it like even darker and like mm, pop out <laughs> so yeah um if you would like to know how to get this look then please keep watching all right so to start off this makeup look i am just priming my eyelids with Too Faced 24 hour shadow insurance primer and then i'm gonna go and pop some two colors in my crease this is matt garcia and matt rosen and this is from the meat matte nude palette by the bomb and i'm just blending that into my crease area this is basically gonna be the start of this look this is what's gonna tie the eyes and the lips all together and yeah next I'm just using a random eyeliner as a base so that my eyeshadow really pops you can use anything as a base and I'm just blending it out because it kind of went a little bit patchy on me and I was too ghetto and so lazy to go to the bathroom and wet my makeup brush. So I'm literally using a little bit of driplets that was left in my setting spray just to make my eyeshadow more intensified. So next I'm going in this Wet n Wild palette. And this palette is called Art in the Streets. And I am popping that yellow shade all over my lid. It does have a little bit of fallout. So you might want to do your eyes before you do your face. Or you can just put some translucent setting powder underneath your eyes if you already do your face and it can just fall out on that. So I'm just going to go back in and blend out my crease just a little bit more. I'm, I added just like a little bit of more of that color in my crease but I didn't do it too much so I'm lightly blending. I'm just going in on the outer corner of my eye with matte Lombardi and this is from the same palette. I'm not really putting this in my crease. Just more or less focus it on that outer corner now because I didn't think this eye look was popping just yet I added some black on top of that matte Lombardi and once I hit my crease area I'm lightly blending lightly blending so it's a seamless look And then I am just putting a wing on it. And this is from the NYC Liquid Liner. This eyeliner, I tell you, is one of the best drugstore eyeliners that I have tried. And So now I'm going in again from the same palette. And I'm using that white shade, Matte Malai. Malai? I don't really know how to pronounce it. And I'm just literally outlining my liner that I did. And this is just going to give my... I look like more of a like sexy vibe like I I love it now I'm just tight lining with Marc Jacobs eyeliner and I popped on some
And now I'm just using that same white eyeshadow and popping that in my inner tear duct. You know, once again, to give this look a more of a pop. And now I'm just aligning my lower lash line with a nude eyeliner by Wet n Wild. I think for darker skin tones, a nude eyeliner looks much better than a white eyeliner. So if you have lighter or fairer skin tones, go with that white liner. And I'm just popping Colourpop's Guess on my lips. And I mix that with a little bit of black eyeshadow to make my lips even darker than the color that it gives me. And for a second lip option, if that lip was too dark for you, I put on NYX Butter Glass Tiramisu and lined it with NYX Espresso Lip Liner. All right, pretty girls, so this is the final look of my makeup. How do you think it came out? Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this um, look. <laughs> it's like it's something that I've never done before and I think the lips honestly they just set it off like you can go with that nude look but I don't know I think that this lip is the perfect lip for it especially because of my like shirt that I'm wearing it just like matches my shirt also so I, I don't know I kind of like the lip with it but I absolutely like love how it came out and I just like keep looking at myself in the viewfinder because I don't know I love it I don't know you wouldn't really want to throw in a bold lip but I don't know if you want to be bold then do it all like I don't see any problem with this um, but no I think I'm gonna wear it out to like a party or something well I don't go to parties so I guess to like Walmart or like to run errands or to the mall or maybe even on a date with my boyfriend I think he would enjoy this look he likes like this type of lip on me and he like weird lip color he loves it on me but anyways if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up be sure to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already subscribed it's greatly appreciated and be sure to leave comments down below of videos that you would like to see from me or tell me how much you like this makeup look I don't know but anyways um always remember that makeup is just another way of expressing yourself and at the end of the day it all comes off and always remember that happy girls are the prettiest. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.